Hello everyone, welcome to another indie horror game from Itch.io. This one's called Panic on Ice and you can own it for a minimum of one US dollar. It's by 616 Games and they're the same people that brought us uh, Midnight Tales Volume 1 and 2. So it's in the style of those um, PS1 style horror inspired by 80s horror movie games. So welcome to the beginning. The game has only two automatic saves. Be careful, we'll die from the cold point of an axe do you want to start a new game yes I do so I have played through this a little bit I got to a certain point and then the game crashed on me so this is my second attempt probably feel I got close towards the end before it crashed on me which was a bit annoying but whatever so looks like I'm on a plane a very low flying plane if those are trees out there which are higher than the plane Martha, lady, are you alright? Are you hurt? Martha, I'm a very cold young man. I can't find my husband. All good. Stay here. I'll look for him. There are only four people on the plane. God bless you, my son. Please find him. Yep, don't worry, Martha. So, the red triangle signals that you're exposed to the extreme cold when it's low. It's best to get somewhere safe so you don't freeze to death. Okay. So I ended up finding her husband around the back of the plane here, and his name's John. Thank God you're still breathing. I'll get you out of here. Okay, let's get you out of here. And John. I recognize that name from Midnight Tales, but I can't remember. <coughs> I got him, don't worry, he's alive. We need to get out of here and find shelter. Martha, thank God my John is still alive. Thanks, boy, for saving my husband. Now we need to survive. That's why we need to shelter as soon as possible. Before the plane crashed, I saw some buildings. It's not far from here. Come, follow me. Martha, could you move with a bit of uh, urgency? Now I guess we wait for Martha to hurry up and get here. Where are you? Come on. I'm getting tired of carrying John around. That's not the correct way. Okay. Floating trees. Oh. It's getting hard to stay here. Winter is getting more and more rig rigorous. Food is running out and I don't know what else to do. I'm stuck here. My only chance to get to the army bunker. Uh, sorry, my only chance is to get to the army bunker. But the cold isn't the only problem. He's out there too with his axe sharpened. Okay, so that must be the nutter that we don't really want to meet. Ah, oh, Martha, there you are. Ma'am, we need shelter. Let's enter this house. Martha, I'm freezing. Please don't let my John die. I'll do my best to keep us alive. Let's go in. You get down there. Martha, you got there fast. Stay here, ma'am. I'll get some wood to light the fire. Build fire, we'll put that and we'll light the fire. Are you okay? Rest assured, we will not let your husband die. I'm better now, my friend, but John needs something to eat. And we need drinking water too. Stay here and take care of him. I'll look for water and food. There must be a bunker around here. 
take care of yourself. I have a compass that might be useful. Here it is. Thank you, Martha. Let's equip the compass. Originally, I thought the line was pointing north, but it's actually telling you where to go, which is great because it all looks the same out here in this frozen wasteland. It's locked. There must be a way to open it. <laughs> okay, valve. Did that unlock it? It sure did. I'll take the syringe. That motherfucker locked me in here. I'm out of food, water and food. I can see him on camera. What does he want from me? Why are you doing this? Ooh. There he is. Up there, so we can't go out if we leave. Oh, it looks like he's gone. I need to get back soon. Okay, let's go back to Martha. This way. Ah, saving. That was our first save spot. Oh. Run, buddy. From what I remember about these games is you don't look back, you just run. I don't look back. Oh, he's quite a way away. In the past, the bad guys were really on your tail. And just by turning around, you'll get smashed. So I didn't find anything to eat. There's a maniac out there. He chased me. Oh my gosh, John, the free weekend needs to eat. What does this man want for us? We have nothing. I don't know, but he doesn't seem friendly at all. We need something to defend ourselves. John is a retired police officer. He carries a gun in his suitcase. How do you get them on the plane? Must be near the plane. Be careful out there, boy. Okay, let's go back to the plane. <laughs> Yeah, mate. Run, buddy, run. I think he took a swing at us. I want to turn around, but I don't. He's <laughs> got far back. They must be pretty fast. Let's see if we can find the gun. So there's no way that I want to go. I guess go back to Martha. What are you doing outside? What are you doing here? It's freezing. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that man took John. You're still alive. Please bring him back to me. Shit, what does that man want from us? Stay here by the fireplace. I'm going to find John and kill that motherfucker. Please be careful. He seems very strong to me and he has an axe. Thanks for everything. <laughs> no worries, Martha. So, this is where I got up to before it crashed on me. I got this ammo. No, he wasn't hiding in there. I did put a round through there uh, on the off chance that he was, but wasn't. So I come up around this corner and I found this. pulled all this corrugated iron off his car and I went there and it said a car I don't think it's abandoned now I went down here and I went and looked at that thing and the game crashed on me so I'm going to stay away from that thing so this is where I got up to the loony's hut uh, 
Are you kidding? So here we are back. Hopefully this time the game doesn't crash. And let's drag this over here and go in. <coughs> Okay, what do we, did we really expect from this? Ah, uh, John. Shit, I'm sorry, John. Some nasty. That's nasty. He's eating people. He's going to kill everyone around here. That damn cannibal. He's going. He's killing and eating people. Is no longer human. In case I forget the password for the safe, it's eight five six. Got to remember eight five six. Let's get back to Martha. Martha. Oh, Martha, what are you doing with that knife? I'm sorry, I couldn't save John. Martha, no, no, my beloved John. I'm not well. I'm very hungry. Calm down, I'll get you some food. Just come in and protect yourself. <laughs> you look very tasty to me. Your meat must be delicious. Come on. Fuck mother. Have you lost your mind? Take the knife. Still got our music going, so is this loony around? Eight. in here. A radio. Equip. Okay, so we want to go somewhere high to use it. On top of a hill. Sounds like a gannet. It's an old church or something. Okay. Let's see if this is high enough. Anyone listening, please help. I need help. <laughs> please, come on. Can anyone hear me? You're not getting out of here alive. There is no way to escape death. Shit, who is talking? It's your right, Dan. Why are you chasing me? Don't take it personally, boy. I kill people to feed myself. Better than starving to death, do you agree? You're crazy, you son of a bitch. I swear to God, I will kill him. No matter how hard you try to run away, today I'm going to feed on your flesh. Okay, whatever. Oops, so I took damage again. So let's go to There he is. Oh, he did quite a bit of damage. Okay, okay, so let's go back to his car and get out of here. There we are. Now, is there someone in the back seat? Another seat? Okay, so I'm not in control anymore. Looks like we made it. But no, in these games, something's going to happen. Who's in the back seat? They should have a couple of bullets in them. 
by right. These windows that are tinted from the outside. We seem to be going very cautiously. I suppose you would over snow. You don't know what you're going to fall into or lose traction. I hope you remember you have a Glock, dude. Your man's got back up, has he? Um, you do have a pistol. Pull it out. Oh, there's heaps of loonies. Come on, come on, come on, come on. So by right, I should be shooting. I said I'd eat your meat today. Yes, you did. Yeah. Anyway, that was Panic on Ice. I'll link it in the description. Cost you a minimum of one dollar should you want to buy it. It's worth it. Had a lot of fun with this game. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.